In this video, we'll be taking a look at three college basketball games happening on January 27, 2024, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three college basketball games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. North Carolina vs. Florida State Florida State is set to host number 3 North Carolina in a highly anticipated Atlantic Coast Conference matchup scheduled for Saturday afternoon. The Tar Heels, currently occupying the third spot in the rankings with a solid record of 16-3 straight up and an impressive 8-0 in the Atlantic Coast Conference, recently secured a convincing 85-64 victory against Wake Forest as minus 8 favorites in a home game on Monday. Meanwhile, the Seminoles, standing at 12-7 straight up and 6-2 in the Atlantic Coast Conference, Conference, maintained their position in the conference with a notable 85-69 win against Syracuse on Tuesday, defying odds as plus three underdogs. Having already faced off earlier in the season, the Tar Heels emerged triumphant with a 78-70 victory at home in early December, entering the matchup as minus 12.5 favorites. UNC boasts a commendable 12-7 against the spread record this season, while Florida State is not far behind with an 11-8 against the spread standing. Despite a loss against the spread in their counter with Florida State. The Tar Heels are currently on an impressive 8-2 against the spread streak in their last 10 games. Their ongoing winning streak is marked by an average margin of victory of 20 points per game. Notably, the Seminoles were the last team to challenge the Tar Heels within single digits. Although Florida State has performed well in conference play, their victories have often lacked strong opposition. With a track record of 6-2-2 against the spread in their last 10 meetings with Florida State, including 2-1-2 against the spread in their last Last five in Tallahassee, the North Carolina Tar Heels win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. In their initial encounter this season, the combined score reached 148 points, falling just under the 157.5 total. The trend of the under prevailing in the last 10 meetings between UNC and Florida State is noteworthy, standing at 7-3. While the Tar Heels have witnessed their last three games going under, scoring at least 76 points in each, and six of their last seven also registering under, their offense of prowess cannot be ignored. Averaging a noteworthy 85 points or more in three out of their last four games, the Tar Heels, ranking 46th in Ken Palm's tempo rankings, are expected to engage in a high-scoring matchup against the 41st-ranked Florida State. The Seminoles have posted 84 points or more in four of their last seven games, contributing to the over-prevailing in five out of their last seven. The closely matched tempo rankings of 41st for Florida State and 46th for North Carolina suggest an up-tempo game, further supported by the fact that the first encounter went under the total, prompting a decrease from 157.5 to 153.5. With Florida State averaging 78 points per game at home and North Carolina exhibiting a 35.2% success rate from beyond the arc on the road, the stage is set for a high-scoring affair. Thus, over the projected total is our full game total pick. Arizona vs. Oregon In the ongoing basketball saga between Arizona and Oregon, the ninth-ranked Arizona Wildcats find themselves standing at a season record of 14-5. However, their recent unexpected defeat against the Oregon State Beavers, where they were 18 and a half point favorites, has raised eyebrows. The Wildcats currently hold the third position in the competitive PAC-12 with a 5-3 record. On the flip side, the Oregon Ducks have managed to break a two-game losing streak by triumphing over the Arizona State Sun Devils with a score of 80-61 in Eugene, Oregon. This victory, coupled with covering the 9 and a half point spread, solidifies Oregon's leading position in the PAC-12 with a 6-2 record. The impending clash between Arizona and Oregon is set to unfold in the first installment of a two-part series on the basketball court. The Ducks, boasting an unblemished record of 10-0 on their home court, view this match as a golden opportunity to make a resounding statement in the current season. Their objective, hand the Wildcats their second consecutive loss. Notably, Arizona has struggled in Eugene since 2015, and the Ducks dominated them last season with a scoreline of 87-68, marking the largest margin of defense 
feet under coach Tommy Lloyd's leadership. Adding to the intrigue, Oregon is set to host numerous five-star recruits this weekend, elevating the significance of the game environment. With the return of the formidable 265-pound Enfali Dante, the Ducks have evolved into a versatile force capable of delivering both inside and outside plays. Having scored 80 or more points in three of their last five games, the Ducks appear well-equipped to keep pace with Arizona. The Wildcats, under Coach Lloyd, face the peril of experiencing back-to-back -back losses for the first time. While Arizona holds a shooting percentage advantage at 48.9% compared to Oregon's 47.2%. The Ducks outshine them from beyond the arc with a 37.6% success rate against Arizona's 36.3%. Moreover, Arizona's track record on the road in PAC 12 games is less than stellar, having lost three out of four. Therefore, the Oregon Ducks to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. Both Arizona and Oregon find themselves among the top 60 teams in the country in terms of scoring offenses. The Wildcats, known for their sharpshooting, are expected to exploit the Ducks' below-average defense. To stay competitive, Oregon's best bet lies in their proficiency in shooting, particularly from long range. Ranking 29th in the country for three-point field goal shooting and 81st in three-point field goals made per game, the Ducks have the tools to challenge Arizona. Complicating matters, the Wildcats play at a blistering pace, ranking 12th in the nation. The anticipated clash has garnered attention from the bookmakers, who have set a high total for the game in an attempt to entice bettors to take the underside and counter the expected influx of money on the over. Traditionally, when high-caliber teams like Arizona and Oregon face off, the value tends to favor the under as both teams contest easier shots, forcing opponents to adjust their game plans. However, this matchup promises a different narrative, with offenses expected to operate at a high success rate, pushing the score or higher. In the last 10 games of the season, encompassing a total of 20 games played, these teams have surpassed the 80-point mark in 13 instances. The Wildcats' rapid pace, ranking 14th at 73.3 possessions per 40 minutes, combined with the Ducks' efficiency at 116.8 points per 100 possessions, sets the stage for an onslaught of scoring. Additionally, the Ducks' ability to excel from beyond the three-point line on their home court should not be underestimated. Despite a seemingly high total of 162, the prevailing sentiment is that it may not be high enough. Brace yourselves for a fast-paced showdown with scoring a plenty, making over the projected total our full game total pick. Kentucky vs. Arkansas In a captivating Southeastern Conference showdown, the sixth-ranked Kentucky Wildcats are set to clash with the Arkansas Razorbacks at the illustrious Bud Walton Arena. The highly anticipated matchup on January 27th promises an exhilarating display of high-octane basketball as both teams are eager to enhance their positions in the conference standings. Kentucky, widely recognized for their offensive prowess, squares off against Arkansas, a team determined to redeem themselves after recent setbacks. The stage is impeccably set for a fierce battle, where strategic acumen and exceptional skills will be pushed to their absolute limits. While the potential absence of Mark and Brazo could pose challenges for the Razorbacks, the prospect of Kentucky notching two consecutive losses this season remains slim. Historically, after each of their three defeats, the Wildcats bounce back with resounding victories, often in double figures. Furthermore, Kentucky boasts superior guard play and holds the 130th rank in rebound rate, outclassing Arkansas. Arkansas, who languish at 231st. The absence of Brazil, a crucial shot blocker and top-tier rebounder for Arkansas, heightens the challenge for the team, especially given his 6-10 frame and 220-pound physique. The forthcoming matchup stands as a critical juncture for both teams, with Kentucky holding the upper hand in terms of skill and strategy. The Kentucky Wildcats, armed with their dominant offensive machinery, emerge as the unequivocal favorites to triumph in this impending clash. Leading the nation in scoring with an astonishing average of 90 points per game, they showcase exceptional field goal efficiency at 49.8% and boast a formidable three-point shooting percentage of 40. These statistics not only underscore Kentucky's ability to score from various parts of the court but also highlight their efficiency in capitalizing on scoring opportunities. Key players like Antonio Reeves, averaging 19 points per game, and Reed Shepard, with four assists per game, play instrumental roles in Kentucky's offensive strategy. The Wildcats' capacity to maintain a high scoring rate, combined with strategic playmaking and efficient shooting, positions them as the definitive choice 
advantage to secure a victory against Arkansas. Their offensive depth and scoring versatility rendered them a formidable adversary, capable of overcoming challenges and asserting dominance on the basketball court. In terms of talent, recent form, and a commendable 11-7 against the spread record for the season, the Kentucky Wildcats outshine the Arkansas Razorbacks. Arkansas, struggling to close out games, holds a lackluster 5-14 against the spread record for the season, failing to cover the spread in eight of their last 10 games. While the atmosphere at the Bud Walton Arena may provide an initial boost for Arkansas, ultimately, talent is anticipated to prevail. Therefore, the Kentucky Wildcats to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Kentucky, with an adjusted tempo of 73.3, secures the 12th rank nationally, indicative of their fast-paced gameplay that facilitates high-scoring encounters. In contrast, Arkansas, positioned at 64th in adjusted tempo with 70.4, maintains a respectable scoring average of 76 points per game. This impending matchup promises to unfold as a high-tempo game, with both teams inclined to push the pace, resulting in numerous scoring opportunities. Kentucky's proficiency in scoring, combined with Arkansas' ability to keep up, alongside both teams' propensity for rapid offensive plays, sets the stage for a game where the total score is expected to surpass the projected total. The offensive dynamism showcased by both squads, as emphasized by their adjusted tempo rankings, underscores the likelihood of a thrilling and high-scoring affair. Both teams exhibit a penchant for an up-tempo style of play, with Arkansas ranking 64th in adjusted tempo according to Ken Palm, while Kentucky secures an impressive 12th position. Notably, the teams have clashed five times since 2020, and all five encounters have exceeded the projected total. Moreover, Kentucky has surpassed the total score in eight of their last nine games, while Arkansas has allowed 77 or more points in four consecutive matchups in six of their last seven games. Considering the offensive capabilities demonstrated by both the Kentucky Wildcats and the Arkansas Razorbacks, over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.